Good morning, St. Thomas More. A few important announcements from guidance. First, for our grade 12 and 12 plus students, a reminder that Mohawk College will be visiting St. Thomas More tomorrow morning at 8.30. If you would like to learn more about Mohawk College's programs and campus life, please sign up in guidance and have your period one teacher sign your permission form. Please note, students that sign up for the presentation must attend their period one class and will be dismissed at 8.30 a.m. with your teacher's permission. Limited spots are available, so please act fast. Also for our grade 12 and 12 plus students, Mrs. Julia will be running college application workshops during periods two, three, and four lunch periods this Thursday, November the 7th. If you want to learn how to apply to college, please attend this workshop on your lunch period. The workshop should not last longer than 30 minutes, so you will still have plenty of time to have your lunch. Finally, for our grade nine students, a reminder that this Wednesday, November the 6th, is Take Our Kids to Work Day. Students that have submitted their permission form will have an opportunity to shadow a parent, guardian, friend, or relative at their place of employment and will therefore not be attending school. If you have not yet submitted your permission form but intend on participating in this learning experience, you will need to submit the completed form to guidance by tomorrow at noon. Students that choose not to participate Will be, expended, will be expected to attend all of their classes where teachers will engage in virtual Take Our Kid to Work Day activities throughout the day. Grade nines, if you have your signed permission form with you here today, with your teacher's permission, please bring it down to guidance now. All this information and so much more can be found on the grade, on the grade level guidance LMS pages and on STM's Instagram page, STM Guidance Instagram page. Have you been following these? If not, you should be. Have a great day, STM. Good morning, STM. My name is Fia. And my name is Lamar. And here are your announcements for today. Knights, help show your gratitude and support for our Can Canadian troops for Remembrance Day. Wear your poppies and please make a voluntary donation on School Cash Online. All students will receive their poppies on November 11th. Your academic tip of the week from your prefects is to take care of yourself. Midterms are around the corner and sleep, exercise, and relaxation are key to keeping your mind sharp and reducing stress. Take breaks in between studying to recharge and avoid burnout. Stay sharp nights and keep moving forward. This announcement is for any boys in grade 9 and 10 interested in trying out for junior boys basketball. They must attend a very important meeting tomorrow after school in the phys ed classroom outside the gym. If you're a member of the junior boys football team, you will be asked to sign up but not required to try out until your season is over. Volleyball season is over and those players are asked to sign up and try out on the first date. Tryouts begin this Thursday at 6 p.m. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Yes, STM, that's right, it's time to start thinking about Christmas. If you're a student here at STM who's in, interested in helping others in our community this year, please pick up an application to join our Christmas Miracle Committee. Applications are available outside of room 151 and must be returned by Friday, November 8th in order to be considered for a Christmas Miracle Committee position. Let us be the first to say Merry Christmas, STM. Just a reminder, there will be a senior girls volleyball tryout at 3 p.m. after school. Attention all boys interested in trying out for senior boys basketball this year. There will be a tryout tomorrow on Tuesday, November 5th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. In order to participate, you must sign up for tryouts using the QR code find, found on the sign-up sheet posted outside the guidance office. All interested must sign up for you for, or you will not be allowed to participate in tryout. Those playing fall sports are also asked to sign up if they want to try out after their fall sports season. Again, only those who sign up will be allowed to try out. Lastly, a signed permission form must be brought to Tuesday's tryout. Forms are found in the main office. See Mr. Giovanangeli if you have any questions. And now for your sports. Your senior boys football team sent the birds from Stony Creek home on Friday with a 38-0 win, punching their ticket to the championship this Friday in Ancaster. The defense was on fire with three interceptions, 
for touchdowns from Emmanuel Okali and two from Rogan Monaghan. Adrian Klinzik Dobiel added all converts and two field goals, and Rogan Monaghan punched in another touchdown on offense. Thanks, Thanks STM. STM. Around the world, people are lighting up the sky with fireworks and dressing up their homes with colorful decor and candles. It's Diwali, the festival of lights. The word Diwali was inspired from a Sanskrit word called Deepavali, which means rows of lit lamps. And that's why Diwali is known as the festival of lights. The five-day festival is celebrated every fall by Hindus, Sikhs, Jains, and some Buddhists. Hindus celebrate Diwali to rejoice Lord Ram's return home after being exiled for 14 years and defeating a king known as Ravan. Jains celebrate the festival to mark the spiritual awakening of their lord, Mahavira. Sikhs celebrate Diwali to commemorate their spiritual leader, Guru Hargobind's return to Amritsar, a city in northern India, after being imprisoned. And some Buddhists celebrate the festival to honor their emperor Ashoka's decision to follow a path of peace and converting to Buddhism, after witnessing a lot of killings. Although these four religions have different reasons for celebrating Diwali, what they all have in common is the concept of new beginnings, light over darkness, and good over evil. Diwali is celebrated with prayers, fireworks, candles lit inside of clay pots, rangolis, which are colored patterns drawn on the ground with colored rice or powder, and it's also a good reason to invite friends and family over. STM, those are all of your announcements for today. The time is now, 9 or 8.24. And, and remember, it's a great day to be a night.